Okay, hi, Alright, we're back. You ever seen Rick and Morty? Oh here. my god, I love Rick and I Morty. I love Rick and Morty. The first time I ever saw Rick and Morty... I didn't like the first episode, and I was like, I don't know how to feel about it. Um, but then, like, I watched I watched the rest of the series for shits and giggles, because I was like, eh, why not? I can't really judge an episode, a show off the first episode. And I was like, this show's amazing. Yeah. I can't wait for season the, two. The first time I ever saw it, I was really high at a friend's house. <laughs> and, um, oh, and the episode I saw was the... Hi, I'm Mr. Meeseeks, and I. Oh, Mr. Meeseeks, yeah. I, I couldn't, I, I couldn't. I was just sitting there watching this, and like after the part where they're like, "We must kill him," <laughs> I was like, "What the fuck is happening?" <laughs> I just sat there for like 20 minutes, and finally, I was like, first thing I said was, "I don't." Oh, that was me. I'm what sorry. What is happening? What is happening? Oh gosh, one of my favorite episodes is uh, it's actually the second episode with the they endow sentience on Morty's dog, Mr. Snuffles. I can't. Mm -hmm. see a thing. And like all the the dogs get the robot suits and take over humanity. Holy shit! It's so funny. I I love good I, cartoons. I love it. You know what? I, it, I feel like you know what it reminds me of. It it's, it reminds me a lot of Futurama. Okay. And in a good way, like because I feel like fu Futurama. I love is, Futurama. By the I way. love Futurama, and I feel like it was one of those shows that it was a way ahead of its time when it came out. Yeah. And that's why it wasn't very successful. Mm -hmm. Fucking door. I'm and I'm like, so I'm like, now. Rick and Morty to me is like the spiritual successor to it, even mm -hmm. though it's technically not. Cause it's not made by the same people. But I'm like, I. Not it's what more I right of now. what I wanted, mm -hmm. so I really enjoy it. You see, I I think that I really enjoy good cartoons because. Like we grew up in that era, like yeah. like the, the kids the kids now I feel so old saying that every time I say that the, the, ki kids, the kids now in, yeah I um, swear I'll I'll run like a pansy if this is what I think it is I I, I the, but the, they they watch so many shows that are like live the fuck you know was they're that? all live action yeah live action shows have you watched they're 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 on like Cartoon Network and like Disney XD and shit but have you watched like Steven Universe or like I mean, I wa I only seen them because um, I know Steven Universe is on Cartoon Network yeah. because I watch like Family Guy stuff like that, and then mm -hmm. I I fall asleep to it, and then I wake up and like Steven Universe or Teen Titans is on. I hate Teen Titans Go. That show can go fuck yeah. itself. I like the original Teen Titans. Yeah. The original Teen Titans was amazing, but like I really really like Steven. I like Steven Universe. Um, there's another show on Cartoon Network called The Amazing World of Gumball, which is fucking hilarious. I I watched that with my mom when I was high once. Uh, and there's well, like, we were both high actually. There's a wonderful on and Disney. We, it, it was it was one of the best experiences of my life actually. On a Disney XD, have you ever seen Gravity Falls? Yeah. No. That show's fucking amazing. <laughs> it really is though. Sorry, I'm not more emotional. No, I right love now. yeah. I love Gravity Falls, but um, mm. also Craig it's McCracken, the guy who did like Foster's Home and shit like mm. that, he has a show on Disney XD now. Stars Jack McBriar. I don't know who that is. Another and door, don't, don't and I'm Jack not about this He was Fixit Felix in Wreck It Ralph. Yes, he was. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's he plays uh, the main character in Wander okay. Over Yonder, which is a pretty good show. Not as good as Gravity Falls, but still good. But mother, I don't want to leave without you. All right, child, you must go. Find Gary, yeah, i and tell him to let the king outrider. No, because I'm a stickler for pronunciation. Please, don't we don't really. have time to make this hole any wider. <laughs> wow. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! Someone is coming! <laughs> Henry, cover the hole with the bed. Everything will be fine. I promise. This is very incesty. Um, yep. I'm sure the way that. we read it. Yeah, I'm sure this is, it was just. Uh, it was I just believe us. the holes under that bed. Yeah, but I need a hammer. Well, hmm. move the bed first. Do it! 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 Superhuman strength. Prison, Northern Black. Northern Black. Uh, should okay. I go down it yet? We, we can't. We gotta get the hammer. What were we talking about? We were talking about, like, show uh, cartoon shows. Yeah. I feel like, like I said, this, like, in the past, like, year, like, cartoons for kids have gotten a lot better. There was definitely a time between, like, 2010 and, like, 2014 when they were all awful. It was, like, it was like a lull. Of... Yeah. Well, they were just, like, the same kind of garbage over and over again. Yeah. Like, yeah. Now cartoons are awesome again. Well, I, I think, and I can't remember who it was that I... I think it was one of you two, but no, uh, it was on the radio show I do I do at school. Mm -hmm. Just I was talking with somebody um, about how we're in such a formulaic society in terms of success. Mm -hmm. You know, like mm -hmm. um, Will Smith was quoted as saying, you know, the reason that he didn't have a uh, good amount of success over the past like four years or so was because you know he had a formula for success based on the movie market. 
mm-hmm. and he would just continually do those roles in a systematic way. Yeah. Movies are the same way. Um, you know, look at the um, the superhero movies we have now. Oh yeah. You know, it's all formulaic because mm-hmm. people, the people making them know what's going to work and what won't. Yeah. So everything has gotten so formulaic, and I think we're finally getting to a point where that's. I think we're finally realizing that people normal. don't like formulaic anymore. Yeah. So we're we're moving away from from that, and like I said, there's a lot of like shows that are coming out now that are really not formulaic, i.e. Rick and Morty. <laughs> what was that that movie that Will Smith was in that he was the superhero? Is that Hitchcock? That's yeah. Hitchcock. Hancock. 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 I like that movie a lot, actually. Guys, the this... movie wasn't as bad as everyone thought it was. Yeah, I, don't, I, I thought it was a good movie. There was, was a lot clever. of hatred dedicated towards it, and I'm like, I didn't think it was that bad, guys. Yeah, I actually enjoyed it. I, 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 yeah, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it for what it was. I wouldn't be like, this was the greatest movie ever. But oh, like, no, definitely not. I'm like, it was alright. Definitely not. That's um, not Land. What? Okay. Huh? Huh? Sorry, I'm... I, I'm a stone. I'm okay. figuring I'm stone out my own death right now. I saw that painting and it made me look at it because I thought it was like a sea of red blood, but no, it's just... No, it's just trees. It's just red corn. It's um, just birds. Which way should I go? Um, oh, hi. Should I go in there? Is that a cell? You should... Or is that more hallway? It might be more hallway, but the point is you need to find Hammer, so... Hammer. Find Thor. Can't, will I be able to pick up Mjolnir? Well, is that no. the name of the Hammer? Are you Mjolnir, and are you, Mjolnir. Wor- are, are you worthy? Good point. I'm not Vision. Hey, mm-hmm. what's this? Oh. Hey, um... I need that later. It's a La Dana Dana Dana. And, um... Jessica. Jessica. I have a professor named Jessica. She's a wonderful person. I'm glad. I, yeah. I have a neighbor named Jess. I have two neighbors named Jess, actually. I have actually. many friends named Jess. I have a few friends named Jess. Then again, our friend cir- friendship circle was pretty really similar. close together, yeah. What's down here? Um, death. Imminent death. You know what? That's no. really the uh, sub-name for this game. It's just imminent death. Oh! Um. Hello, Michelle. She has a nice name. Whoa, fuck me. Fuck me. <laughs> fuck what, everything. What did, what did you hear? Woo! I want my barrel back. What did you hear? I want this really close to my face. Was it a gooby? Yeah. Turn around, I think he's on the other side of that. Oh, fuck that. He can have the barrel. Yeah. Yeah, because I think I saw your vision go all wibbly wobbly when you looked at the door. Yeah, I think he's back there. So I think you're safe because he's behind a padlocked gate. But the thing is, you gotta open, you gotta open it. <laughs> no, I don't. It's locked. Well, I mean, you have to. I think the hammer's back there. Hammer. So, you have to rescue Is Hammer. That, do I use the pick lock on that? Um, hold on. Look at look at, look at, at the lock again. Put the barrel down. Do I pick lock? You can lock? see it. You're fine. You can see it. Barrel's not getting left down. <laughs> no, I wanted you to add to, to click on it, to talk to it, and see what it said, because I didn't read the, the I'm hypertext. really going crazy over here. Should I use this? No, la- laudanum's for, for that medical. That's your sanity. So I use the lamp Yeah. There you go. There oh, you go. It's so wibbly wobbly. Ugh. That's because I'm in a fucking prison cell. <laughs> in pitch darkness. In the middle of a castle. Jesus. With something trying to kill Jeez, me. Jeez, Parker, all the flavors in the world. And you pick salty, okay? <laughs> you guys have been talking about movies and shit. And I'm over here about to die. <laughs> okay. Talk to the lock. You need to find some wow. umami. Okay. In, it is in good shape. I think... What? Something just shouted and I didn't like it. <laughs> <laughs> you can try using the hollow Pardon needle. Me. Um, I think you're gonna need more. I think you're gonna need, like, acid. Cannot use item in this way. Yeah. You're gonna have to melt it with acid. So we should take bets on how he's gonna die next. I, I would imagine by the hands of a gooby. I think... How can you die from have I gone? Holy shit. No, you, insanity just kind of hinders your progress because you fall on the ground and start, like, crawling <laughs> on your side. How insane is that? crying. Because you, because you literally cannot even. Yeah, and crying for your mother. Jordan wouldn't like this game. Jordan. Why? Alan. 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 Yeah. I don't know any other Jordans. My, I, I know another Jordan because I'm related to one. I know a few Jordans. Well, I imagine it wasn't that Jordan. Well, I, I didn't know. Which way should I go? Um, the correct way. Um, you know what I'm gonna do? I don't. 
Feral's going to protect me. I'm going to come into here and listen to this guy scream. And I'm just going to hide in the corner. And while you do that, we can go um, to the next time on PS Gamers. Yeah, and uh, this is where I will be when you come back. So, uh, send help. Okay, bye.